Brian Lehrer on WNYC at the Republican Convention. We are out at the corner of Market and Fifth in St. Paul, where there is a lot of activity, as you can probably hear in the background. And we have with us a delegate named Casey Jones. Yes, Casey Jones from Arizona. Uh, tell us, sir, what, where you're from and what's great about your hometown. I'm from Sierra Vista, Arizona. It's in southeastern Arizona, southeast of Tucson. What's great about it is that it's co-located with, with Fort Huachuca, Arizona, which is, which is unusual in itself. But I spent 20 some odd years in the Army and, and the synergism between Sierra Vista and Fort Huachuca is something I'd never encountered before and that's why I chose to retire there. What kind of synergy? It's one community. It's not the fort and it's not the city. It's it's a community for what you can see our vista. And what are people talking about right now there as far as the issues? The issues, uh, our big issue down there is, is uh, my, my house is as the, as the crow flies maybe 15 miles from the Mexican border. So border security is, is the issue there. How does illegal immigration affect your community? It passes through our community. Uh, they don't pass through without some impact. There's a terrible loss of human life uh, coming across the border. The immigrants themselves in in the in the desert, they perish in the desert. Uh, the coyotes, the smugglers, put them 20 or 30 in a in a van and roar down the road. And and just with probably two three weeks ago, one left the road and killed 10 people. It's a terrible loss of in, in, in waste. So what should be done about that in your opinion? We need to secure the border. They're working on the border fences. It's a very difficult situation. Uh, we, we're going to have to clamp down on, on the hiring in our country. Uh, it's a demand pull thing. Whose uh, delegate were you elected as? First, I, I'm an alternate delegate. Uh, but we're committed to uh, Senator McCain. I guess from Arizona, that's a pretty good bet. Well, it's, uh, it's, it's why we're in the hotel closest to the convention center, the whole nine yards. Yes. We've got a great uh, walking distance location here, a beautiful hotel, the St. Paul. Do uh, you support Senator McCain's position on uh, immigration, which is too, quote unquote, comprehensive for some Republicans? Not totally. Uh, it is too comprehensive for some of us. Uh, by any other name, amnesty is amnesty. Uh, and it, it, it's simply not uh, equitable for those who get in line and go through it legally to uh, allow so many to, to just jump that line. In general, how would you rate your enthusiasm level for Senator McCain, 1 to 10? Well, right now it's got to be about 9-8. Uh, he, he is our candidate. I think he uh, made a wise and totally unexpected move with uh, Governor Palin, and uh, that's that's going to add a little spice to the conversation. What does it mean to you to be a Republican in 2008? Well, it means to me, uh, I, I, I write a piece weekly or monthly for a contractor's organization in town. I, I just finished one. Uh, the Republican Party offers to me the best opportunity to preserve and remain in effect and further effectuate our Declaration of Independence and our Constitution. That to me is the most important thing because that will affect my children, my grandchildren, your children, and your grandchildren. Those two founding documents are the most important thing. I think Senator McCain and the Republican Party offers me the best the best way to do that. Did you watch Senator Obama's speech Thursday night? I did. Uh, there, there's, I, I will say quite frankly, to me, Senator Obama is an empty suit. Uh, there's no there there. Uh, he's a tremendous order. Uh, he, he can't off the cuff. He's one gaff after another. And, and that's a shame. He's, he's, he's an obviously intelligent individual, but uh, I don't think he's there to, to be next to the button.